from game breaking glitches to chapter three leaks this is 20 secrets in rainbow friends starting with you can actually hide in the water and i don't mean just like crouch in it and sit like this you can actually hide from the monsters and they will not chase you so you need to get in a place just like this and as you can see i'm literally under the water and now it's supposed to Oh, there's a box on me. Now, if I, imagine if I didn't have this crayon head. I would be completely invisible. What is this lady doing? But seriously, if I sit here and the monsters come, they will not see me. It's crazy. And here he comes. Here he comes. And he did not see me. Look at that. Now, let's go see what Doodle's doing. This next one isn't really a secret, but it's that Arky's ugly. This next secret is quite possibly my favorite secret in all of Rainbow Friends Chapter 2. Rain, please do not grab me. Thank you. Okay, so yellow, I need, oh, I need you for this glitch. Okay, you scared me. All right, anyways, yellow can make the roller coaster fly. Let's see if it works. Okay, Emmanuel, really? You had to ruin this glitch. Let's do this glitch successfully. It glitches the roller coaster. Now it is flying in the air. Emmanuel is in it with me. Where did he come from? <laughs> oh, he jumped off. Oh, no. Oh, I forgot to jump off. Okay. Oh, Emmanuel is going up in the air. What is going on? Okay, so this next one brings us all the way over to Purple's Lair. I never saw this, but if you come over here, you go into Purple's Lair. Don't get caught by Purple, of course. Then you come over here, you would go up the ladder and not really look around, right? But as it turns out, there's a secret calendar with that date being July first and it's circled and it says field trip so some people are speculating that on july 1st of 2024 is when chapter 3 is going to release or some people think that july 1st is the day that we took the field trip in the first place back from chapter 1 so who knows what this means i have no idea but circle on a thingy it's got to mean something right and it says field trip very nice calendar uh definitely some secret meanings here what do you guys think leave a comment down below now let's go see what idiot doodle is yapping about probably his mom all right, so the next one is you can get underneath the map. So if this still works, the way you do it is you come to this rock right here. You climb up this boulder as well. If if I could do it. Oh, yep, okay. And then you push yourself to the side and eventually you climb up on this mountain. He's not in the rainbow, friends. And from here, you can walk across the rocks. Uh, and Blue's upset that I'm up here, obviously. Yeah, he's shaking his head. I, I have made a friend. That's one more than Arky. So now I should be able to drop right here and then end up underneath the map. Let's see if it still works, please. I don't want to be eliminated. I want to live this game. Three, two, one. And it works! Okay, so we are underneath the map, and as you can see, you can literally find everything that they use to make this game under here. They have all the monsters, and they also have the Robot Blue. I wonder if Robot Blue will be in Chapter 3. We'll have to see. This guy has followed me underneath the map. Now, another thing I bet you did not know is that... Oh, it's green! I hit green. Now, another thing I bet you did not know is that... There is a very small plushy blue. I'm not too sure why, but he's in the trash. They put him in the trash. I think it's for a reason, but you come over here. You look, there's a bunch of rubble, a bunch of nonsense, a bunch of trash, trash bags. And in the box is a baby blue. What does this entail? And to make it worse, it's right outside of Blue's castle. I'm not too sure if this uh means anything but it's here if you guys ever wondered and i hear a fatty oh it's blue and that's just a bonus extra um there's actually a reference of doodle's mom in the game right there all right this next secret is way better than any of arky's secrets because honestly He's stupid. So this one has always been interesting to me. You can actually use your box while driving in the go-karts. If we're just driving around in the go-karts and then we use our box, it works. Honestly, this makes the go-kart look sick. Okay, I don't know what Doodle was talking about, but I'm sure this one's gonna be much more interesting. So as it turns out, if you come over here and do a little emote, you can get out of the map. Wow, something really interesting. Hey, how's it going? Much more interesting than whatever Doodle had to say. Uh, that's all I have to say about that. Uh, but if you go ahead, open up your email wheel, and then you just do this, and then start moving over. No, I missed it. Okay, no, well, you just do this, and... Ah, nope, didn't work. And, yeah, we're gonna figure this out. Whoa, uh, oh, that's, that was a close one. I know it was. Ooh, ah. Okay, um, maybe it's been patched. 
I don't know. But either way, I'm going to show you someone else doing it. So this is from a channel called Flush. Seems like he has some great information, but you watch it. You see he goes here, here and then he gets <laughs> yeah, through the map, easy, which I think actually, they may have passed. That's kind of where we're at with our content. We're using other people's content. We're turning into a reaction YouTuber. Um, try it. Oh, I just did it. Never mind. I take it back. I am the greatest. I'm, I'm, I'm very smart. Hey, pal. Hey, palski. <laughs> Alright, let's go uh, explore a little bit. You can see we're over here. Oh my gosh, you literally have free reign for everything. This is insane. Look at the trees. Can I walk through this? Oh, they're fake trees. My life has been a lie. Oh my gosh. Let's go over here. Let's see what this is about. Uh, Rainbow friends, please don't ban me. Oh, there's a slant. I can get on top of the building. Oh, ho, ho. Oh, no, I can't. I just walk right through it. My entire life is a lie. This is insane. Okay, well, they're about to get all the light bulbs. I'm gonna see if I can actually just teleport through this wall here mm. yeah oh i think that worked i don't know but yeah very interesting let's go see what doodle has to say the next secret is you can fly in the lobby of rainbow friends so i know that sounds weird but there actually is a way to do it and arky is gonna help me out with this because he's nice okay what is that ugly pumpkin dude you know what else is festive all right Ah! Okay, we're gonna do this. Essentially, you have to put your box on. And he's doing a handstand. Arky! I'm not in a call with him right now, so he's not listening. You have to do this with a friend, by the way. So if you both get into a box and you start pushing into each other, you start to fly. We are literally flying, and I don't think it stops. We're gonna actually see how far we can go. Look, the Ferris wheel is even in the distance. Like, that's insane. So we're still flying up. We're flying up. How far is this gonna go? And he let go. Okay, but the secret works. Okay, so for this next one, I'm gonna need a monster. Come here, Mr. Monster. Come here, Blue. No, don't chase. Yes, yes, come here. Okay, so I bet you didn't know in the Rainbow Racers map, they cannot get you. For some reason, they're just scared of uh, the Rainbow Racers track. Uh, he just kind of sits there. Not too sure um, why he does this. Let's see if I can hit him with this. Come here, Blue. Blue. Hey. Hey. And as a bonus, I want to see if we can actually run Blue over with the uh, heart. Come here, Blue. Come on. Come on. Let's go. And sit. Oh. Oh, Mr. Blue. And he can't catch you either when you're in the when you're in the, the, the cart thing. Yes. Very nice. All right, Arky. That secret was cool, but you're still stupid. For this next secret, this is actually one that was put in the game by the developers. Some of you guys may know it, but there's actually a note hidden in this area. You have to do a little bit of a glitch to read it, but we're going to go ahead and read it because I've never actually seen what it said. Let me go ahead and crouch and then stand up. Oh, we see the note. What does that even say? I don't know. I think it's a meme. You guys might have to tell me in the comments. I, I really can't read it. Now for this next one, I need to find yellow, and apparently there's a very weird secret on the outside of the map where there's Blue's brother. I don't know. This is gonna be odd. Come here, yellow. Take me outside of the map. Okay, 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 okay. Boom. Oh, I died. Okay, this one, surely I can make it, right? Right? right I'm dead. Alright, round three. Am I gonna be able to get it? Yes! No! Round four. <gasps> Boom! I'm dead! Oh my goodness, I'm wasting so many gems <laughs> just for this. Yellow must be really enjoying this. Um, okay, I have to hurry. There's nine out of ten lookies found. Boom! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, it worked! Okay, we're good. So, if you come over here, I need to hurry. I need to hurry. Someone's about to find the last lucky. Please don't. Once you're out of the map, you need to come all the way over here. I need to run faster. There's only one lucky left. I hope they don't find it. I just spent a very long time trying to get this completed. Now, a lot of people think that this is just the edge of the map. Like, there's nothing else over here to explore, right? Oh, the last lucky is highlighted. This is bad. But if you come all the way over here, and then you jump off the edge of this part, you actually have a whole secret area. And not only that, but there's literally a secret blue over here. Some people think that this is Blue's brother. It's like an animatronic version of him. It's very weird. Who knows what this is? Um, but yeah, that is undoubtedly blue. Hopefully I can get close enough. Uh, it looks like the Lucky is still... Okay, they just picked it up. I gotta hurry. But yeah, guys, literally, look at this. Look how weird this is. He's literally just walking in place. He's floating in midair. Or maybe this is a hint towards something in the future. Maybe chapter three has something to do with an animatronic version of blue. You can literally see 
clear as day that this is animatronic Blue. Like, I don't know what else you need as proof. Some people think it's Blue's brother. Some people think it's like an evil, like a more evil version of Blue. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows what chapter three is gonna have in store? And we just finished it. Okay, just in time. Let's see what Doodle's doing. Okay, this next secret is better than all of Arky's secrets combined. I actually didn't believe this was true at first, but it is. So the secret is, if you go in Purple's lair, the other rainbow friends cannot attack you. So if we get blue right here, oh my gosh, that scared me. And we go ahead and we walk in and crouch so that purple doesn't eliminate me. It works. Blue just stopped attacking me. Let's see if you can also hide from yellow in purple's lair. Come this way. Hello, green. Oh my gosh, green almost just grabbed me. Okay, so we're gonna walk in, crouch. He can't attack me. This is amazing. Someone did comment though that Cyan has a different reaction to walking into Purple's lair. So we're gonna have to get to the night with Cyan in it and see if it's any different. Okay, let's see if Cyan is any different with Purple's lair. So we appeared. Go ahead and run, 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 run. Is it gonna be different? Oh, Cyan didn't get down here. Oh my gosh. I'm just trying to do this secret, all right? We need to see if the comment is true about it being different with Cyan. Cyan, I'm right here. Run after me. Okay, you're scary. Nope, run after me. Cyan, oh! And purple's lair. Okay, it's not different. The comment was wrong, but that is okay because honestly, it would have been cool if it was different. Now, the next one I bet you did not know is that you can actually leave the lobby um, just by walking through this fence. There's a break in the fence. I think they accidentally um, added this. I don't think this was on purpose because if you come over on this side, you cannot see the fence at all. Um, that's kind of weird. And then you can actually walk down this path and there's some secrets back here that I don't think the developer is trying to show you. Come back here and you can tell they obviously just kind of staged it to make sure that nobody can see this. But you come over here, you go all the way back through these trees and all the way over here, you can see it starts to kind of slant down kind of is a little interesting huh so if you go ahead and uh go over here you can see to the right this is where the vent is obviously where you can kind of go explore a little bit and come down here you can see some place where i guess you go when you're being teleported it's a bunch of people doing their thing over there i don't know uh but yeah and here's the vents that you can literally just kind of walk through i have no idea why this is in the game but come over here and as you can see there is nothing under you except for this red ring who knows what that is i certainly don't if anybody knows you tell me you let me know in the comments because my brain is not that big let's go see what doodle is talking about all right, the next one is if you go into Purple's Lair and crouch, you can't get eliminated. We know this one is true. I'm gonna taunt Purple a little bit. I'm taunting Purple. Okay, I'm crouching. And boom, we don't die. He just sits here and really wants to eat me. Hello, Banana Man. On to the next! Now for the next secret, I bet you didn't know that there's a way to get into Yellow's Nest without actually uh, dying by Yellow. And that way is you just come over here, find this rock, you walk up the rock. Oh gosh, Blue's gonna see me. Blue, don't see me. Thank you very much. Then you'll see another rock and you walk up that rock. And then you just kind of shimmy your way up and glide up to this thing. As you can see, I'm literally glitched into uh, the icy part where the zip line is. Now, a lot of people think that this is the farthest that you can go, right? You can't go too much farther than this, but if you come over here, you go on this rock, you can actually get on top of the map. And then with you being on top of the map, you can, of course, drop down into Yellow's Nest. You can literally just sit here. Um, I'm not too sure what happens uh, from here, but you can get into Yellow's Nest. That's pretty interesting, if you ask me. Let's go see what Mr. Doodle is uh, thinking about. Probably french fries, because he's fat. The next secret is if you go to Green's roller coaster tower thing, the Rainbow Friends can't eliminate you. So we have to wait for a Rainbow Friends to see us. I don't even know where Yellow and Blue are. Did they leave the game? What? Oh, I see Yellow and Blue. This is perfect. Let's hide in the box. And then you ready? You ready? I'm gonna appear. Okay, he sees me. He's going to attack me. Run into Green's tower. Look at him. This is beautiful. He can't attack me at all. Oh, they're all here. They can't even see me. What if I wave at them? Okay, oh, oh no. Hello, Blue. Okay, so we are back at the water for this one. This one's actually really interesting because it could have some sort of hidden meaning. Who knows what this means, but I'm about to show you this is absolutely crazy. But if you go in the water, you can actually see you hide in here and you tilt your camera up and the sky turns cyan. What does this mean? I have no idea. Maybe it's just a glitch. What are you doing? I personally think it could have something to do with Cyan. Maybe it's a hidden meaning that Cyan is going to be in Chapter 3. I don't know. I have no idea. Uh, but yeah, very interesting glitch. It's daytime now. Um, 
cool. Whoever that guy was that was talking before me is stupid and ugly. For this next secret, you can actually take a poop in Rainbow Friends. You can go to the bathroom, okay? That's what this secret is. If you go ahead and you run to the Ferris wheel area over by this bouncy house, and you just keep walking along, you might wonder what this is. And this is exactly what you think it is. It is literally a porta potty that has been turned into a hiding spot from the Rainbow Friends. So technically, you can go to the bathroom in Rainbow Friends. I don't know why they added this, but it's kind of interesting. Oh, and it's convenient since Blue is running after me. I'm hiding. I just took a dump. And the last secret is there are two blue thrones. So as you guys can see, this is like the main throne. But there actually is another throne somewhere else on this map. And I'm going to show you guys in a second. Two thrones could mean that there's a brother blue that shows up in Rainbow Friends Chapter 3. It could be for the robot blue that I showed you earlier underneath the map. I'm not too sure, but we'll have to see in Chapter 3. So the way you actually see this secret blue throne is by going on the roller coaster. All right, so we're on... Which way did that guy just go? <laughs> what? Well, I guess that's another secret. I didn't even know that. That's awesome. You can actually go through that way on the roller coaster. But anyways, back to the secret about the blue throne. If you ride the roller coaster through this way, all throughout here, through the lucky pond, and go all the way up here. Oh my gosh. This is terrifying. And you go down, you can actually see a second throne. Look at it. It's right there. That could mean it's Brother Blue. That could mean a secret. I, I don't know. That could mean anything. But overall, that's pretty cool. Hopefully, we see something with that second throne in Chapter 3.